everyone thanks for joining me and this is top talks i'm lexi and today i'm joined by stephanie howard so thank you for joining us so almost every person in america has one and it's man's best friend and it's a dog <laughs> so we're gonna talk about what you should expect when you're handling when you're getting a new puppy so Stephanie is a first time pet owner. So this is her first dog and he's, his name is Gus and he's still a puppy. So what were you expecting when you got your French bulldog? Cause that is what he is as a Frenchie. Um, so we had to do a lot of research. Um, French bulldogs are typically more expensive. So we had to do a lot of research on that and make sure we're getting it from the right breeder. Okay, and then so when you got him, what, what were some things that you think people should know when they get a French bulldog? Um, so the main problem that you're going to run into with a Frenchie is going to be their breathing problems since their faces are more scrunched up. Um, they are more prone to the heat. If you're living in a hotter state like we are in Texas, you have to watch them and make sure that they don't get overheated because they'll get overheated faster than your, you know, other dogs. That's good. Oh, yeah, that's really important to know, by the way. And so if you're just now joining me, I'm Lexi and this furry face that you might see this is Gus and we're talking about all things French Bulldogs and what you should expect if you're um, looking into buying one or adopting one so if you're new to owning a French Bulldog what are some of the general tasks that you think some people should go through once they have their dog um, if you're getting your dog from a breeder or from anyone really um, take them to the vet just in case you never know Gus had kennel cough um, that's pretty common for puppies if they've been if they've been around a lot of different puppies. Um, get them on a schedule. Start potty training them as best as you can. You want to get Frenchies really like to chew on stuff, obviously. Um, so you want to get them a lot of chew toys. And then, um, so what's the best thing about having a French bulldog? Because I I've heard that they're very friendly dogs. Um, yeah, he's super friendly. He likes playing with other dogs. He likes playing with our two other dogs. And he likes going to the dog park. And he's super friendly. And he loves attention and all that great stuff. <laughs> so is this a dog you should get if you're living alone or if you have a family? Or is it kind of both? Um, I would say both. He's good with families and being by himself. So he plays well with others and kids if you do have a family. So Frenchies are pretty much the perfect dog to have for anyone. So thank you for joining us today, Stephanie. That This was so helpful. So if you're interested in buying a Frenchie, then just take our advice and get one. <laughs> but be careful because they're very expensive, so you have to think about that. So thank you for joining me, and I'll see you all next week on Top Talks with Lexi.